gonna wrap up, I have to bring this young man up here. He's 19 years old. He's got more hot spot than uh, you know what. Um, his name is Ariel Katz. He has his own radio show. He wants to give a very quick uh, <laughs> remarks about what's happening right now. Ariel, come on up. Hi, everyone. Today, how's everybody? First of all, I'd like to thank everyone who made this amazing day happen. Really, you guys get a round of applause to everybody that is here. I'm standing before you not only today as a Jewish New Yorker, but as a 19-year-old college student, a proud son and a grandson of Holocaust survivors. Growing up, I heard the heartbreaking stories of what my grandparents went through during the Holocaust and the gradual buildup of fear to the heart-stopping footsteps of German soldiers. Now seeing, listening, and witnessing the, the ferocious attacks on the Jewish community internationally, abroad, and, and most of all domestically in our own neighborhoods rocks me to my own core. I now see that anti-Semitism is currently here today, silent and festering all around us. From Israel to Washington to here in New York. While seeing these unimaginable acts of persecution, I took to the radio to make a difference in the community to stop the hatred from every direction, from anti-Semitism to racism, and to help facilitate positivity in the world today. Especially in times such as these where a guiding light is needed. I want you to take a moment right now, look at yourself and look at the person right next to you. You are human beings and we're joined here today to make a difference. You're here to take the united front, not only against anti-Semitism, but the racism of, of all cultures who are targeted in today's world. It is one step at a time, day by day, we're making a difference, not only for our generation, but for our next generation and the future generations of our, of our generations. Showing that we are united, showing we will not hide in fear, and we will not take the hating or any forms from politics to random tax on our own people. In conclusion, I hope I, my words have made a difference here today. Remember, spread the love, spread positivity, may God bless us, and may God bless the United States of America.